As commencement weekends come to a close all over the region, a Cumberland woman who worked really hard can finally breathe a sigh of relief. I love this lady. She's proof that age is only number when it comes to fulfilling your lifelong dreams. NBC 10 Sam Reed shows us someone good. As many know, the month of May is a very big deal for college seniors all around the country and right here in Rhode Island. May means the beginning of summer and the end of a chapter as thousands turn their tassels at graduation. But sitting peacefully on a patio in Cumberland, a simple sip from 71-year-old Gail Davis's cup tastes a little more sweet. I was determined to become Dr. Davis one way or another. Right out of high school, Gail wanted to be in the medical field. She finished three years at Salve Regina, met a man, got married, and had kids. She put her career dreams temporarily on pause. I went back to school in 1976 after my second was born and finished in 79. I got my bachelor's of nursing in, from Rick in 1979. From there, she worked in the field and then went on to get her master's in public health. And then in 2020, she enrolled in the doctoral program. In the height of the pandemic, I was giving um, COVID vaccines at the dunk. Back then it was the dunk, um, like right and left. All while working as a graduate assistant and a substitute nurse in two communities. Working and sometimes taking three classes a semester was a little overwhelming. And some semesters I thought I bit off more than I could chew. But Gail, who's now a grandmother, doesn't believe in excuses. So I tell my students, you're never too old and it's never too late. Which is why this moment at 71 years old. Congratulations, Gail is worth saviouring. Gail was among the 2023 graduates at the Rhode Island College commencement. And it was very emotional being that I did it. I finally did it, even at my age. I think I was the oldest graduate there. Thanks to the ongoing support of her family and her determination, she's now a doctor of nursing practice and has earned the title of Dr. Davis. It was very fulfilling to say that, you know, I, a self-accomplishment that I finally did it. She says retirement is out of the question. She's exploring her career options to find the best fit and says this next chapter will be one for the ages. Remember the words to live by that you're never too old and it's never too late. If you want something, go for it. And that there will be people in your life that will support you. Showing you something good. I'm Sam Reed. Hi, everyone. It's Mario Florio from NBC10. Thanks for checking out the NBC10 WJAR YouTube channel. Click the links on your screen for more stories from across southern New England. And don't forget, hit the subscribe button below and get notified anytime we post an update on YouTube. As always, thank you for turning to 10.